Hi, my name is George, and in this video, we're doing a side-by-side -side comparison of ClickUp versus Monday.com, two of the most popular tools for managing projects and teams. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear idea of which one might work best for you, whether you're leading a big team, running a small business, or simply looking to organize your life. We'll talk about their features, ease of use, pricing, and everything in between. So let's jump right in. Before we get started, just a quick note, some links in the description are affiliate links. That means I may earn a small commission if you decide to make a purchase through them, but this won't cost you anything extra. Now, let's get started. When you first hear about ClickUp and Monday.com, it's easy to think that they're just project management tools, but they're more than that. Both have evolved into full-on work management platforms, which is a fancy way of saying they can help you manage more than just tasks. They're great for things like customer relationship management, CRM, team collaboration, and even brainstorming ideas. Both platforms promise to make your life easier, but they go about it in very different ways. If I had to sum it up quickly, ClickUp is the tool for people who want to customize every little thing about how they work. It's packed with features and gives you tons of control. But let me warn you, it can feel like a lot to figure out at first. Monday.com, on the other hand, is like the user-friendly, polished app that looks good and works smoothly right out of the box. It doesn't have as many options for tweaking things, but that's kind of the point. It's easy to use, which makes it a great pick if you just want to jump in and get started. Let's talk about how easy each platform is to use. When I first opened up ClickUp, I was overwhelmed at all the options and features. It took some time to figure it out, but once I did, I saw how powerful it could be. You can customize your dashboard, change how tasks are displayed, and set up automations to handle repetitive tasks. It's great for people who enjoy personalizing their tools and exploring all the possibilities. Monday.com, on the other hand, is much simpler to get started with. The layout is clear and easy to navigate, so I immediately knew how to use it without needing instructions. If you prefer a tool that's ready to go and doesn't require much setup, Monday.com is a good choice. Now, when it comes to features, both platforms have a lot to offer, but they approach things differently. ClickUp has every kind of feature you could think of. Lists, boards, calendars, Gantt charts, mind maps, and much more. This variety is great if you have specific needs or like to work in different ways, but it can also be overwhelming. I found myself spending a lot of time just exploring all the options before actually using them. Monday.com offers fewer options, but they're presented in a way that's simple and easy to understand. It doesn't overwhelm you with choices and everything feels polished and just ready to use. For example, its Gantt chart feature is straightforward and even lets you add baselines to track your project's progress, a small but helpful touch that a ClickUp doesn't offer. One thing I noticed is that ClickUp's mind maps are great for brainstorming ideas visually, while Monday.com's graphs and charts views are perfect for teams that need to track data and performance. So depending on how your team works, one might stand out over the other. Both ClickUp and Monday.com let you automate tasks, but they do it in their own ways. Automations are super helpful if you're tired of doing the same things over and over, like updating a task status or sending reminders. ClickUp offers a lot of flexibility here, and it's very generous. Even its free plan comes with 100 monthly automations. If you're on a paid plan, you get unlimited automations. But here's the catch. Setting them up can be tricky. You'll need to wrap your head around things like triggers, conditions, and actions, which might take some time. Mondays.com automations are much simpler. Setting them up feels like filling in the blanks of a sentence. For example, you might set up something like, when a task is completed, notify the team. It's just that straightforward. The downside is that automations aren't available on Monday.com's free plan. And even on the standard plan, you're limited to 250 actions per month. If you need more, you'll have to upgrade. Now, when it comes to integrations, connecting these tools to others like Slack or Google Drive, ClickUp takes this crown. It supports over 1,000 integrations compared to Mondays.com's 200 plus. Both can connect to other tools like Zapier, 
but ClickUp's wider range of options makes it a better choice for teams that use a lot of different apps. Now, let's talk about collaboration. Both platforms make it easy to work with your team, but again, their approaches are different. ClickUp has built-in chat, email, and even a tool called Clip that lets you record your screen and share it directly within the platform. This is perfect for things like explaining a task or giving feedback. Monday.com has great collaboration tools too, like task comments and team updates, but it relies more on integrations for things like chat and email. That means you'll need to connect it to apps like Slack or Gmail to get the same functionality that ClickUp offers out of the box. One feature they both share is image annotation, which lets you comment directly on images or mockups. This is a lifesaver for design teams or anyone working with visuals. ClickUp has the edge here because it pairs this feature with generous storage space, making it easier to manage and store large files. Performance is another area where the two defer. Monday.com is incredibly stable. Everything runs smoothly and I didn't experience any glitches while using it. ClickUp, however, had some hiccups. Tasks sometimes took a few seconds to load and I even had a couple of instances where things I created just disappeared. While ClickUp constantly adds new features, it feels like they might be sacrificing stability to do so. If reliability is important to you, Monday.com wins here. Finally, let's talk about costs. ClickUp offers a lot of value for its price, especially on its lower tier plans. For example, its unlimited plan gives you unlimited tasks, dashboards, and storage, which is hard to beat. Monday.com's pricing is straightforward, but you'll need to go for the higher tier plans like Pro to unlock most of its advanced features. If you're on a tight budget, ClickUp gives you more for your money. But if you're willing to pay for a polished experience, Monday.com might be worth it. So, which one should you choose? Well, if you're someone who loves customizing things, doesn't mind spending some time learning a new tool, and wants the most features for your money, ClickUp is a fantastic option. It's especially great for smaller, tech-savvy teams or individuals who like to experiment and tweak their workflows. Now, on the other hand, if you want something that's easy to use, looks great, and works reliably without any glitches, Monday.com might be the better choice. It's perfect for larger teams or anyone who values simplicity and stability over endless options. At the end of the day, choosing between ClickUp and Monday.com comes down to what fits your needs best. One gives you tons of options to customize everything, while the other keeps it simple and easy to use. There's no wrong choice. It's about what works best for you. To learn more about ClickUp or Monday.com, make sure to check out the links in the description of this video. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time.